Hello everyone, make sure before we begin the gameplay footage, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, hit that notifications bell so you guys will be up to date on everything I upload onto the channel, and also don't forget to go down to the description down below where you guys can follow me on my Instagram, my Twitch, my Twitter, my TikTok page, and the Facebook page as well, where I'll be posting as regularly as I possibly can, so without further ado, let's get straight into playing some Batman Arkham Knight. Hello Paige. Alright. I'm gonna be the flying fucking rat. I'm gonna make sure my TVs are somewhat reasonable for. Fuck off. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I am Batman. <laughs> no. I am the Batman. <laughs> There we go. Alright, I don't know what I've... I wasn't even paying attention to what I was doing then for a sec. Jim, we've got a way to find out where Crane's working from. Thank God. What can I do? Get your Bitch, you're the Riddler. As soon as we've got a location, I'll let you know. Alright. Yes, it is I, Edward Nigma. Oh shit, I can't even fucking... Some freaks chaining up dead bodies. Sounds pretty nasty. Let's go see. I forgot this is like still like tutorial level stuff. <laughs> the opera music will have to wait. This is going to be a bit of a pain in the booty hole, but I do plan on doing everything in this game. Your allies won't help you tonight, Batman. I will be the end of you all. <laughs> batsy, batsy. That coffee's a bit way too sweet for me. But I'm gonna drink it anyway, because it, otherwise it'd be a waste. Damaged. I need to bypass it and power the antenna directly. Hello again, Mr. Wayne. How can I help you this time? Is the power winch ready? Lucius. It's 100% functional. Though no guarantees if you're intending to pull that car of yours up <laughs> the side of a building. You read my mind. It's in the job description, Mr. Wayne. Batwing's on its way. <laughs> what why send my car while well, I can send my jet? <laughs> but I also use the car too. <laughs> We should get more Batman games when you get to play with the car. Yeah, the car is in the start of this, yeah. So I think they just wanted to try and use the vehicle as much as possible for, um... Because obviously they knew it was going to be like the main gimmick of this game. That was unfortunate. <laughs> I 
There we go, I got it. <laughs> I don't need to position myself in the air, I'll be fine. I'm just gonna destroy these balls because I can. And also because it's funny. Considering the fact that it's even funny, this is like not even my first time playing this. This is like the third or fourth time I've played this game. But this will be like the first time of me actually doing majority of it. I feel like that this realistically could have gone really wrong. <laughs> I just end up trying to swing from building to building with the vehicle. Let's <laughs> just imagine like just some random criminals just stood there. They just there, just chilling. The next thing you know, you get cr your head crushed by a fucking <laughs> three-ton vehicle. I've restored power to the radio antenna. Great, I'm connecting now. I was just talking to Robin. I think you should too. Bruce, you need me out there. We can find <laughs> No one wants to talk to Robin. Robin fucking sucks. Can wait one night. Let me help. No matter what version of Robin it is, he fucking sucks. Listen, try checking in once in a while. We're partners, remember? He just wants to help, you know. Is the antenna ready? Yeah, but we're going to need a microwave tower to triangulate Scarecrow's location. There's one at Falcone shipping in the cauldron. I've marked it on your map. Thanks, Oracle. The Batmobile's powering the antenna. I can't use it right now. I thought I could use my car to get to across the city, but apparently not. I'm not allowed. Because I've not played this game in forever. <laughs> Especially Jason. Now, everyone loves Jason Todd, though. That's the trouble, because he becomes Red Hood. Why do they want a Batman? But also, in the context of this game, he ends up becoming um, Arkham Knight instead. Whoa, my frames then for a sec. Whoa. I have no idea what's happened. <laughs> we're wasting time. We've got the run of the whole city and we're stuck up here guarding some antenna. You heard what the boss said. We lose control of this mast. They can track his location. Scarecrow's men are guarding the antenna. I need to evaluate the threat and plan my attack. Hold up. <laughs> I think I might have to turn the graphics down a little bit. <laughs> If I just turn it down just a little bit slightly and turn off motion blur because motion blur is just not fucking needed. Alright, hopefully that should run a bit. There we go. Much better. Five soldiers, all armed. If I alert them, they'll kill the hostage and need to reach a vantage point to draw them outside. If I can separate them, they'll be easier to take down. There we go. Stays locked. 
Let's go see how badly we can scare these dudes. Ah, yes, the notification of my previous live stream I did is now fully rendered. <laughs> Well, he's now suffocated. Three more soldiers inside. They think they're safe if they stick together. <laughs> well, they ain't. <laughs> they, no one's Just safe. A hostage situation. Three gunmen. I need to take them all out before they can react. Is it ready? Flexible plates over an MR fluid armor layer. You'll move faster, hit harder, and look scarier while doing so. Send it, Lucius. Now. Already airborne, Mr. Wayne. Nice. Now I wait. <laughs> To be honest, with this one being the um, Game of the Year edition, I don't know if I've got any of the like, most of the DLC at least. Because I remember I did get this for free, so <laughs> along with the other Arkham games and all the Lego Batman games, so it could be either or. Because I remember Epic gave me that all the games were free because it was the well they gave it to me on the 80th anniversary of Batman. Yeah, the DLC for this game especially was really good. Are made of a titanium triweave. It's between those layers where things get interesting. Wayne Tech MR fluid hardens in response to impact. With this kind of shock absorption, you'll be able to Yeah, mostly cuz they ended up adding like more like so I was going to say slightly better villains in it. Like you had characters like um Killer Croc and Mad Hatter and all that. Added as a DLC. Kind of like with the Arkham City one where you got to play the Harley Quinn's Revenge DLC as well, where you got to play as just Robin. Because that one was supposed to take place like a few months after um, the events of Arkham City. Even though that could have been its whole, a whole game on its own. But then for some reason Rocksteady turned around and went now. You know what, I might as well do these AR trainings because it gets me extra um, points and all that. It gives me extra upgrade bits and pieces so it'll be fine. I nailed it. Simulation activated. <laughs> they need to get good. <laughs> yes. There we go, didn't even have to think about that. Alright, talk to you later.
bad man. Bastard. There we go. Continue, because last time I tried to do it back on the Hexbox, I accidentally restarted it. Neat. Simulation activated. There we go. I think I got the gist of it. <laughs> I did it. Yay. <laughs> Nailed it.
Non. Neat. <laughs> I am so smirk. <laughs> Three gunmen, one hostage. Time to move this suit to the test. The Batmobile's powering the antenna. I can't use it. The new suit is faster and more mobile. By getting close without... There we go. Dead, dead, dead. All of them. Dead. <laughs> Help me. Why? They said you were quick, but I never saw anyone take down three armed guys like that. Unbelievable. You're safe now. I'll send someone to pick you up. Thank you. Tell me you're gonna find Scarecrow. That son of a bitch needs to be stopped. <laughs> I'll try, but I don't think it's gonna work. Not yet. I need to access the console. Oh. Ah. Big brain. Oracle, I've attached the uplink to the microwave tower. Perfect. I made an anonymous call to GCPD. They're gonna I like how his eyes turn completely hostage. white. Come on, come on, connect. Love the suit, by the way. Okay, both towers are fully online. Time to find Scarecrow. Hmm. Huh. Go find the skilly man. Yeet! I need to use both antennas to identify the micro and radio wave frequencies across Gotham. If I can find both frequencies at the same location, I'll know where Scarecrow is manufacturing his toxin. Radio and microwave frequencies point to ACE chemicals. <laughs> That's where of course it would in the toxin. Jim, I've traced the fear toxin to ACE chemicals. That's where we'll find Scarecrow. Impossible. I've had a team there ever since the evacuation started, just like you asked. Crane must have bought them off. Or worse. I'm in the area. I'll round up my guys and head over. Hold off until I get there, Jim. I'm on my way. Oh, I do have the DLCs. Oh, wait, do I not? Oh, it requires me to actually get to um, the specific points of the game. Alright, cool. Makes more sense. Alright, so I guess I've got no choice but to do the actual missions then, I guess. There we go. Come on, you gotta fly. Any word from inside? Nice. Nothing. 
We think there's a skeleton crew left in there, but they're not Ooh, responding. My phone's overheating a little bit. Down. If they're still alive, I'll find them. They should be able to tell us what Scarecrow's up to. Uh, Ooh. What the hell? Oh no! Oh, let's go! Come on, move! 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 Take cover! Let him fight the clowns! Time to die, old man. In death, he has nothing left to fear. Keep him away from Ace Chemicals. Your vengeance will come. Tonight. Yeah, just like all the other um, Batman games, this is supposed to take place over the course of one night. Sure. Friend of yours? Stay here, and I'll go find out. Huh? Actually, I'm curious. I uh, know obviously I'm doing a theme. I wanna see requirements complete twenty four percent thirty four percent twenty seven percent. See if I just do these in order it'll be it'll probably be fine. Yeah. Come on, let's play some uh, good old Gotham themed World of Tanks. Oracle, whoever this guy is, he's assembled an army. I need a name. All right, we've got something here from a black ops team operating in Venezuela. They discovered a hidden training facility housing soldiers bearing the same insignia. There's nothing but speculation on their commander, though. The only thing sources agree on is his name the Arkham Knight. The Arkham Knight. <laughs> the Arkham Knight. Packing that sounds stop. fucking stupid. <laughs> know what they're planning. Anything else? There's a crew of Ace Chemicals workers left on site. They'll be able to help us track down Scarecrow and locate his bomb. I need to find them. Each worker will be carrying a unique ID chip. If I can access their personnel records, I'll be able to track them. There's a security terminal in a booth near your location. Try there. There were five soldiers, each one armed and dangerous. Before I can access that terminal, I'll need to take them down. <laughs> Go do the Batman thing. Yeah, I didn't mean to go in hard already. Bitch, you fucking thought! It's safe to access the terminal. Come on, let me access it. There we go. Let's see if Oracle was right. Data connection active. Data decrypting. Someone needs to upgrade their security protocols. <laughs> Coming from the man that's literally just managed to hack into it with ease with his retarded levels of technology. Oracle, I've got the ID codes. If I reach a high vantage point, I can use the bat scanner to locate the workers. Okay, I've marked the tallest structure in the area on your map. Try not to fall. <laughs> well, where's the fun in that? 
There we go. This is perfect. I can release the bat scanner and search for the workers. I've managed to intercept some radio traffic between Scarecrow and this Ark of Night. Relaying it to you now. I had him in my sights. I could have ended it right there. We have not broken him yet. It will come. Now I've waited long enough. That man dies. Tonight. Why do you hate him so much? You can never <laughs> understand. I hate him because you abandoned me. This is his last night. I'll make sure of it. Any idea who the Arkham Knight is? Sounds like the two of you might have some history. I've made a lot of enemies. All right. Now the real question is, what order do I go for him in? So obviously these games don't like to spoon feed it to you. I'll take the one from the furthest away point, and then it should hopefully be easier actually. Or at least I'm hoping that's the way to do it. Get to the point where they have a lesser chance of calling for security quickly. How the fuck did they know it was me? That is the wrong button. Doesn't mean we can't have some fun. Just need to, you know, not kill him. There we go, that's what I'm after. Smoke pellet. Or unless. Nailed it. This guy served his purpose. What's the point of keeping him alive? The only way to rescue the worker is to pull down that wall. I need to get the Batmobile into the compound. I'll get the factory entrance open first, then I'll bring in the car. Alright, so now I gotta fucking summon the tank. Wish I'd signed up for airborne. Should've known I'd end up on guard duty. Let's go to the internal route. Don't worry, it's nothing. Just a glitch. Okay, so it's finally started. Phase one is a go. <laughs> Your ass is mine! <laughs> you now have no kneecaps. Oracle, they've killed one of the workers. Damn it. We've got to stop them. Listen, I've managed to hack into the militia comms network. You'll be able to listen in on any channel wide broadcast from now on. Thanks, Oracle. I found a way to get the Batmobile into the compound. They'll pay for this. All of them. <laughs> Damn, he did. Oh well. <laughs> Not my fault. Gates open. Time to bring in the car. How did he get in there so fast? Oh. 
gonna play some World of Tanks. Neat. Sir, punch through the armor, just like you said. He's searching for hostages. Keep non-essential radio chatter to a minimum. He'll be listening. You are listening, aren't you, Batman? Then listen to this. To all embedded units in Gotham, Operation Savior has begun. Each one of you has a role, and each of you knows your role. So move out of this damn city and lock destroy all that. Our hands wrapped tight around Gotham's throat within the hour. That was easy. <laughs> And of course I spoke too soon. So <laughs> Nice. You said something. Leave him out of this. Always defending the weak and the helpless. That's what I like about you. Predictable. That's why we're gonna win. We know your move before you do. We know how you think. Do you know what I'm thinking right now? <laughs> of course. You're thinking, who the hell is this guy? No. Tifa, the mocap for this game I'm is actually pretty to good. Decide which one of you I'm going to take out first. And just so we're both on the same page here, I fully, fully intend to kill you. But first, we're gonna make you suffer. We have the target. Just say the word and I'll end this now. Gotham will be ours. <laughs> okay, Jason Todd. You don't understand. Keep your guns on him. If he tries anything, shoot to kill. I still can't believe this game came out nearly 10 years ago as well. <laughs> Your ass is mine! The only way they could make, like, obviously, I'm pretty sure we didn't have the technology at the time anyway, but um, I'm pretty sure, like, if they did, so you're gonna let when you do a combo on someone, like, they should just show, like, Batman shattering bones and stuff in the detective mode. He was. Stay calm and tell me what you know. They've been running the plant for hours, they brought in trucks. Weapons, soldiers, shipments of hazardous materials. They knew exactly what they were doing. He's producing his toxin on a massive scale. It's a bad. Real bad. We're talking about a gas cloud that could cover <coughs> the entire eastern seaboard. Where do I find Scarecrow? I, I... I got no idea. All I know is he's moving ahead with his plan. And he's got a whole freaking army backing him up. We're screwed, Batman. I'll stop him. But first I'm getting you out of here. Wait by the Batmobile. Have you found Scarecrow? Not yet. It's worse than I thought. How much worse can it be? He's building a bomb. Well, big enough first of all, looks like you have no mustache. Johnson. Also, hello, Arkham Knight. Your men and get out of here. Head to GCPD and lock it down. Keep everyone inside. I'll get my men off the streets, but I'm going nowhere. You bring anyone you find to me. Jim. It's too dangerous. You'll stop him. 
I know you will. Alright, let's get this little bitch boy back to the other side. Let's go. Hold tight. I'll get you to Commissioner Gordon. <laughs> it's four or two. Ah, so you are, uh, I'm assuming like in America, maybe? Because currently, where I'm at right now, it is currently 10.02. Ah, I was right. <laughs> We're not done yet, Jim. I'm going back for the others. <laughs> so I'm assuming, judging by the timing, I assume you're probably... Wild guess. East Coast, maybe? Yeah, there's no way that's gonna work. So what I'm gonna need to do... Hit <laughs> yes and no. <laughs> there we go. Neat. My biggest enemy, weebs. But then this is also coming from a fellow weeb myself. I managed to conquer the League of Demons and stuff, but this like no. They should have better sword training. Good. Actually, we'll bring it back a little bit. Uh, there we go. I live in Florida, but the part where I live in is like the east slash northwest. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I've never been to Florida. But then again, the only part of America I actually have been was New York. But that was about, I want to say, seven-ish years ago? No. No, about six. <laughs> I don't like this country, not going to lie. Uh, to be fair, the UK is probably no different. <laughs> Nailed it. Do they have energy drinks in the UK? The yes, we do. But what is it? Part of the UK law specifically is if you're gonna have an energy drink, you gotta be uh, 16 to purchase energy drinks. I'm gonna take down the medic as well because I know he's gonna be a problem. This was it, yeah, like the most energy drinks we have in the UK. We got um, Relentless and Monster and Red Bull. Like, you know, your standard stuff. Do they have ghost ones like the USA have? Um, no, I don't think we do actually. 
unless you go to like a very specific store. I know there's like a um, a small little store where, uh, well, near where I live, where they actually sell um, cans of G Fuel. Only downside is G Fuel tastes like shit. <laughs> Like, I tried, like, most flavors of G Fuels. I thought, like, maybe it's just a flavor thing. That's two dead workers now. Oh, this is your favorite? This. Nice. But I've never tried it, so whenever I... If I ever get the chance to, I probably might give it a shot. If I ever come across a can of it. Look, I've been talking with Robin. I really think you should consider letting him help you. My favorite ghost is the red berry army. sour patch. Right. Oh, that sounds actually quite nice, actually. <laughs> I can handle it, Robin. I've told you what you have um, to do. Now do it. Thanks. What is it? No, like the only en no, American energy drinks I've ever tried in my stay. life. I've tried um, stay focused, or things will get worse. G Fuel. Much worse. So I remember someone was selling the oh the Warheads candy flavor. Yeah, we we do sell we do have uh, Warheads in the UK. That is actually fairly common round here. So was it that and uh, Toxic Waste as well, which I believe is American as well. If Robin can't save people, the fallout will be every bit dangerous as scary. But yeah, the only flavors of G Fuel I've ever had was um, I suppose we had um, the Crash Bandicoot one. Mostly because Crash Bandicoot is like one of my favorite games, and I saw it for sale, and I thought, you know what, I might as well. Didn't like it. Thought it was awful. Then I tried um, Gamer Sups because I ended up getting the free samples from them, and thought that was actually pretty nice. Wait, do people in the UK speak English there? To answer that question, it's um, a bit of yes and no. <laughs> because we have like different regional accents. If that makes any sense. Because like depending where you are in the UK... Um, you will have like, obviously different dialects for the UK. But you try and speak to someone with a Scouse accent like, even we down in the south have no idea what the fuck they're saying. That's three dead now. These animals are going to pay. We'll stop them. We always do, right? I mean, because obviously the UK comprises of uh, multiple countries at once. Because obviously we've got England, the UK. Like, even just England itself. As, like, a multitude of different languages. Like, um, the I was born in West Virginia. Ah. So like, uh, I'll say like, country folk-ish, but the only thing I know of West Virginia is, well, the closest to a West Virginia accent I've ever heard, honestly, is, um, Chris Chan. Which I know it's like an old, obviously an old meme now at this point of Chris Chan. Especially with all the stuff that he did this recently. <laughs> Be like, I don't have like too much exposure to stuff in America, but you know we try. Lots of mountains and trees and rivers and snow. Ah, it's like real country stuff. If I'm going to reach the worker, I'll need a way to get inside this elevator. Ah, shit! I went a bit too high. <laughs> But yeah, like, I do really wish to go to back to America again at one point. So obviously there's other bits of um, America that I want to go to, like um, this is as high as the elevator will go. Going to um, Universal Orlando and going to um, Disney World and stuff like that. Like mostly like the LA. So I know like LA is like one of the main parts of it. Where I was born, you would live miles away from others. Damn. That sounds like majority of the area where I live. <laughs> like most of it around here is literally just like countryside. But then again, every single town that you come across, like most of the population are either crackheads or old people. Sometimes old crackheads and really aggressive teenagers. But then again, the whole thing, like in, um, was it one of my favorite quotes from Hot Fuzz? 
it is actually very accurate to you to the UK. Did you not realize that my name is after the main villain? Yeah, I did actually. Yeah. <laughs> Is a very clever joke. Oh no, you don't. But now, yeah, I've only been. Well, I recently decided to go back and uh, play. Arkham Knight because it's been almost a year now since I've been live streaming and when I first started doing live streams I was doing a Batman Arkham Asylum if you google Batman isn't even supposed to be the main character I am <laughs> I mean to be fair the game is named after you so uh, <laughs> I don't see why not it's okay you're safe you're too late we're both already dead you know about the bomb he's building right where is he I heard him saying he was in the central. Like I would say, like the the one major good thing about this game is getting ready to release this toxin. Well, it's the blatantly obvious part. Is like this is the last good game that Kevin Conroy lent his voice to to play Batman. Because I see Kevin Conroy as the ideal Batman to me. You out of here. Get to the elevator. That's also because I just love the animated series from the nineties. Is this your first playthrough? No, this is the. I'm coming to you. I think it's like the third time I've played this. He's in the central. But through these live streams, I'm going to be doing over the course of um, however long it's going to take me. I'm going to end up trying to do every little thing I can throughout the series. But I'll stop him. You have my word. Because obviously, once I um, finish doing these live streams, I end up just obviously posting them straight onto YouTube, which you could probably find. I think you can find it on my profile's bio, but I'm not 100% sure. But considering the fact that majority of my content on here is mostly just anime and stuff that I like to talk about, because you know it's just you know general interest. Oh uh, so you know my origin story? Yes, I am fully aware that you are Jason Todd. <laughs> But it was kind of cool in this game that they actually showed the um, the crowbar incident. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, it's like one of the most iconic moments in gaming history, so... Not gaming history, um, comic history. But no, I do live stream like... Oh, please don't talk about the C word. <laughs> <laughs> Um, but what was it now? Like, I do live stream like every now and then whenever I get the chance to. Mostly, because I work part time, so I try my be my hardest to do what I can for a live stream. But I am also live streaming other games at the moment as well. Like, I'm doing this. Um, I'm also doing Sea of Thieves and um, Crash Bandicoot 4 as well, because I thought, why not? Um, but yeah, like, I, I just do what I can and plus I do a lot of reviewing on uh, chat on my main channel as well because YouTube is obviously where my main stuff would be well would lie I only use YouTube for vids oh. how's many YouTube on the sub? Um, I only recently hit yeah, I only recently hit um, 100 subs quite recently. So I know I did have a little bit of um, issue. Yeah, a little bit of an issue with YouTube's copyright thing recently because I did a vote where I asked people, like, what movie would they want to see me... Well, not movie, but like, what would they want to see me talk about on the channel next? Because I did a Dragon Ball video recently. And obviously with the positive reception I got from so many people, which I very much appreciate. I, um, yeah, I asked them what they wanted to vote, and then obviously everyone voted for One Piece. And I thought, okay, cool. Like, people want to see me talk about um, the most recent One Piece movie? Not a problem. I'll do that. But then next thing I know, when I was editing the whole thing... Um, YouTube kept bringing down the copyright hammer on me. <laughs> yeah, 
because yeah, it was also mostly because I had um, a lot of my videos pre-written beforehand as well. Did I get him? Hey. My captain fucking dissed One Piece. Damn. Damn, you dissed One Piece? Scarecrow is preparing the bomb in the central mixing chamber. I need a way in, and I need it now. I'm working on it, but I'm gonna need a couple minutes. Find it, Barbara. Patience is a virtue. You've heard that, right? Damn, that, that, that's a bit of a L right there. So was it because, um... You're like, One Piece, like, no doubt about it, is hands down one of my favorite. Well, when it, if I had to compare the, both the source material, like the actual manga, compared to the anime, um, I would personally prefer the manga overall. Like, personally at least. Then he dissed me five times and betrayed me and tried to assassinate me seven times. Sheesh! These two were lucky. Scarecrow's forces have murdered the other workers. Bastards. It's a bit of an L. Back to GCPD, <laughs> but be careful, Jim. There's militia all over Gotham. What are you going to do? I'm going to show Crane what happens when he met them. Oracle, I need that route to Scarecrow. We're running out of but time. what is it? I do have like some other um, animes and stuff that I plan to talk about on the channel. But mostly it's just because I'm doing a little bit of a recovery time, mostly just doing live streams and stuff at the moment. I've sent you the location. What are you going to do? Improvise. So the ones I got planned up at the moment, I've got um, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part Six because of, so I already did like videos on previous parts of JoJo, so I thought you know what, why not? I might as well cap off the series. Then I got other ones as well, like um, Baki, Full Metal Alchemist, like you know, just the standard stuff, really. But I like to let the audience choose what I do. He blew up my APC with me in it and shot me and stabbed me and tried to burn me and tried to kick me to death and tried to poison me. Damn, that's rough. What do you think they're planning? First, we need to focus on stopping Scarecrow. Then I'll deal with the night. <laughs> That's got to be rough, man, dude. All because I dissed him one time for shits and giggles. That is a that is a massive L. But you know, I, I believe that you know most people are entitled to their opinions. I mean, if you don't like One Piece, you don't like One Piece. I mean, it's not a huge deal. I mean, it just is what it is. Batman, I think I found a weakness in those drone tanks. I'll investigate and report back soon. Oh, it's like where um, one of my friends from college actually dissed um, Dragon Ball. Mostly by bitching about like saying how like it's just so old or it's way too long, it's fucking based. I was like, meh. Covered by that sentry gun. I'll have to take them out. There's a mod where it changes the cobra tanks. Ah, cool. Don't let him scare you. But he's driving a tank. A car. Yeah, I don't I don't usually um do mods or anything like that. Well, I only I would only mod like specific games. We are thousands. He is good. We are better. Huh? You really did go to the briefings. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. I can destroy the grate. Do you use Discord? Nah. No, I don't use Discord that that much. Mostly to the point where I just got to the. It's like Snapchat. Like once you use it, like you use it a few times, and you like it just is what it is. There are tanks everywhere. The bastards must have been planning this for weeks. Dig in and do what you can, Jim. 
I'll deal with them as soon as I've stopped. Yes, I tried using Discord before and I thought, you know what, it's not for me. Do I know Fallout 4? Yeah. I'm not really that big of a fan of Fallout, honestly. Like, if I... It's like the big comparison that some of my friends always tried to get me to choose. Like, do I like Fallout or do I prefer um, Borderlands? Like, if I had to pick, I would say I'm more of a Borderlands fan than Fallout. Kick these guys' asses. It's Batman's fault I became the Arkham Knight. I mean, to be fair, I feel like Batman's responsible for like most of his enemies existing. <laughs> Ultimate methods of these games. Just mash buttons and you win. I'll let him get one lucky shot. It's fucked up, he replaced me and didn't even look for the body. Yeah, I mean, that's the downside to it, really. Oh, uh, that wasn't even a crack. That was, that was disappointing. <laughs> He needed control of the plant. Only Ace Chemicals has the facilities to build. Because yeah, was I think the only part of Batman media that I've actually been disappointed in is when they did the Death in the Family animated movie. I thought, okay, this is gonna be cool. We're gonna get one of the greatest um, graphic novels adapted. You probably would have done the same thing if you were me. Yeah. Yeah, I probably would. Because, I mean, you got to actually, you know, if the evident if someone did die, obviously you got to try and see if they actually did. But yeah, like, I was really pissed when um, they did the animated version of... Well, when they said it was going to be the death in the family. My favourite Batman movie is The Dark Knight Rises. Uh, for me, it's Batman Returns. Like, the, the mostly because it, it doesn't help with the fact that I grew up man. being a Tim Burton fan, or but, <laughs> like, to be honest, I, I do a prefer, like, the, well, when it comes to live-action Batman, Michael that. Keaton is my favorite. We're about to turn Gotham. <laughs> Coast of America into my yeah, like, Michael place. Keaton is my favorite Batman of all. But also... Batman Returns also likes to ease its way into not being one of my favorite Batman movies only, but also being one of my favorite Christmas movies as well. <laughs> They'll never fill the gas. That'll be fine. Oh, is that how you want to play it? Let me knock your friend out and it'll be funny. No, I'm not. Hey, you're using smoke. Stay down. I'll sit this poor for like 24 hours just to see if they'll fill it with gas. I mean, at least you managed to see if they'll do it or not. Zip. I feel like they should have done like a better, um, like when it comes to live action Batman movies in general though, I feel like we should have gotten a better um, Scarecrow. Like Cillian Murphy, I feel like was actually good casting.
No, I didn't. It would be cool if Batman wasn't fast enough that Scarecrow sets these chemicals off. True. <laughs> it's like, that is a fact. Gotham is going to pay for what his savior did to me. Okay, come on. Boom! Oh, how many is left of them? Only three. You're too late, Batman. The place is gonna blow. Yeah, get the hell out of here while you still can, Bat. Come on. There we go. Emergency. Last radius is at 31 miles and driving. Ghost recon. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Tom Clancy ain't got shit on me. Like Sam Fisher wished he was able to pull the six skills that I got. It appears that the flow of chemicals has stopped, which can only mean that you are here, Batman. I've been looking for. How did he know? <laughs> for some reason, I feel like the USA government allows most of the sexual and violent games. Um, weirdly enough, that is actually true. It's like, in the UK, we only are able to slither through with a few games here and there. It's like how um, the Punisher on the PS2 was almost banned in the UK because of the um, the glory kills and interrogations and stuff in game that you were able to do. But when they released the console version, they um, they were able to get away with it over it by putting a horrible like black and white filter over it and oversaturate the camera as well. But whereas if you had the PC version, you were actually able to play it entirely uncensored. How do I shut it down? Let me go, or she dies. But then again, you also got like, um, other games that you would think it banned in the UK, but they surprisingly didn't. Like, um, like the Postal, like every single Postal game didn't get banned in the UK, which is kind of funny. There is some gum gig games in the USA where you can actually do sex, which is wild. Nice. It's like one of the few games I know that you can do that. Like you got um, House Party on Steam, which I do have. Mostly because I learned about that game through Game Grumps. I'm gonna quickly get some upgrades. There we go. And then, y'all. Yeah. Neat. Alfred. I heard what that maniac and obviously, you got like the Leisure Suit Larry games as well. Unfortunately, with no success. Keep trying. Alright. Come on. There we go. Uh, the US even allows games where you rip people's heads on hearts out. Yeah, we do have some games like that over here as well. Like you got your Mortal Kombat, your Manhunts, Mad Worlds, um, sp uh, Splatterhouse, you know, games like that really. Metal Gear Rising Revengeance as well. <laughs> Wolfenstein's Brawl. Yeah, it is. These canisters are highly volatile. I'm going to have to move slowly. Be very careful. Sir, I urge you to reconsider. Evacuate now. If you're caught in that blast, you will die. There's no other way, Alfred. There's always a way, sir. Please. I'm just going to trudge on over and drop this highly explosive gas canister. Predator Hunting Ground has insane glory kills. Yeah, I really wish I was able to play that game. Although I do have a PC. I wasn't able to play it because um, 
mostly because I have like no one that I knew that was able to play it. And also the fact that um, I know that they've shut down the online servers for it as well. Where is she, Alfred? I have no idea. It's my fault they took her. She was aware of the risks, Master Bruce. She'll be as angry as you are that she's allowed this to happen. But I also wish that we had, um, like a re- I know, like, um, bit of a hot take, but I do think, like, Rockstar Games should actually give up on making GTA 6 and actually focus on other game series that they've done. Like, obviously, they they very much mistreated Ghost Con Real while well, was actually a gold game. I'm not really too sure on the Ghost Recon games. I've played them every now and then whenever I get the chance, but I don't know that those games just never gripped me, personally at least. But I can see the appeal. Be like I was saying earlier, yeah, I feel like with um, Rockstar Games, like they should just stop doing GTA 6. Do the right thing. That's all that matters. And focus on getting other games ready, like. Um, like they did like a remaster of Manhunt or something like that. Cancel GTA 6, yes. Because it's going to be like the most overrated thing ever. Just like GTA 5, it's just going to be super overrated. <laughs> GTA 6 kind of looks like ass. <laughs> I mean, given the trailers that we've had so far, I would say yes. Oh, there we go. Because like, um, well, we gotta face it that Rockstar pretty much dropped um, Red Dead Redemption at this point because they pretty much just left that game to die, really. And the day GTA 6, GTA fan, fans be like, "Where's GTA 7?" <laughs> yeah, I mean that that, that is a fact. Like I guarantee, it's gonna run into the same issues. Miss me, a. Hey. <laughs> Was that Jared Leto? I'm gonna kick his ass again. But yeah, um, I feel like when GTA 6 comes out, it's gonna run into the exact same problems what GTA 5 did. Like the campaign will be running for absolutely fine and all that. It'll probably take a bitch to um, download. Yeah, the day after GTA 5 came out, yeah, they wanted GTA 6. Yeah, that was actually true. Unfortunately. But yeah, I feel like it's, like, it's going to be a bitch to download, considering the fact that the size of the game itself is going to be like a ridiculous amount of memory storage. And then you also got um, fucking what's it? The um, great. Gotta try to think what was it is. Supposed to get in. Voice pattern analyst. The, G the GTA 6 graphics look like, actually look ass compared to this game. Unbelievable. Yeah. And weirdly enough, this game's nearly 10 years old. <laughs> Which even still shocks me. To be fair, if I had to pick out of all the um, out of all the Arkham games, I would say out of my favourite one personally is definitely Arkham Asylum. This game looks better than GTA 6, almost 10 years old. That's wild. Yeah, even I still can't believe it. Like some of the games I always look fondly upon, I always keep forgetting how old they actually are. What the hell is this place? This team was behind door number one. Ah, oh, the venture course. Venture request. You have to get me out of here. They've locked me up. Running test like I'm some kind of I was shocked to see how bad GTA 6 looks. Yeah, I mean to be fair, I feel like with all the DLC and the constant updates and stuff for GTA 5, I think that's pretty much like what killed GTA in general for me. Well, I did even get the um was I even bought the fucking 
remaster trilogy that they did for GTA 3, Vice City, and San Andreas. I played it, it was fucking terrible. Miss me already, Ben? Oh, it's you, Commissioner Boredom. What have you done with my soulmate? If you try to come between us, I'll carve you a smile so wide your head falls off. <laughs> You can tell she's the kind of person that has a Batman tramp stamp. I'm just saying, GTA 6 doesn't even look realistic. No, it doesn't. Oh, oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me. You are the police commissioner. Your face was on that billboard they replaced with mine. Nick, yeah, because what was it? I feel like... What are you waiting for, old timer? Like, Rockstar should just give up at this point. They should just focus on other things. Like, give things what people want like make a manhunt 3 make a bully 2 make a like actually focus on fixing red dead redemption's online system well you know just do what you can what do you want pig come in here eyeballing me you think you can police me nobody polices the goliath damn ah I'm glad you came, Jim. Batman! You need to see this. <laughs> I feel like the trainer is wrong, and when the game comes out, it will look like GTA San Andreas graphics. Joker yeah. Joker disinfected blood out to all the hospitals in the city. Yeah, the trailer, yeah. I know, we tracked it all down. We missed some. How? Oh. Like, it's just gonna look terrible. Like, I guarantee people are gonna end up rushing it. Like, it'll end up into a whole, like, fucking... Cyberpunk situation where people are gonna like the game company. I do believe that Rockstar can make a good game. Like they could legitimately make GTA 6 a good game, no doubt. But the downside of it is it comes down to um, the fans. I would say, like they would be the ones that would want them to rush the production of the game. I mean, it already got delayed once already, so I mean, it was kind of expected, really. He's been I bet when GTA 6 comes out, it's gonna have so many bugs you can't even. Yeah, exactly. Like this is what I mean. Like it's gonna turn into like a cyberpunk situation, where the fans are gonna want the game to come out sooner rather than having like a game that actually functions. Like I know cyberpunk is obviously functional now after a couple patch updates, but still, it's pretty much a similar situation, really. You can't hold him here against his will. We're close, Jim. We can't let him go until we save the others. Wait. Which reminds me, I probably might said end up getting around to properly playing Cyberpunk at one point. So no... GTA 6 is probably gonna be ass. I'll wait till the reviews come out first, then I'll see what happens. I know the PC version will definitely have issues. Because usually when it comes to games with rushed productions, it's definitely gonna have major issues. I'm not getting Can GTA 6. Me, I, would, I would say... Yeah, you pay... Yeah, you have to pay monthly to get it. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'd rather not. Yeah, like, I'd rather not pay monthly to play a game. Because I think the UK price of it that they've set... I think they said it was going to be like £70, which is going to be like... Well, the conversion rate if I move... Yeah, I think... Yeah, like 70 pounds in the UK. I think if I do the conversion right, we're looking at about yeah, it's gonna be 150 dollars here. Yeah, so it'd be roughly around the same, like pretty much. So I know like actually no, yeah, I think it's gonna be like to flat out own. It's gonna be like a shitload regardless. Alright, where do I drop the gas can? Or do I have just have to get out? No? Alright then. Yes, I'm really here. And no, you can't kill me again. Oh, come on. This time. I'm having a bit of a mental bruh moment. Warning. Explosion imminent. Explosion imminent? You don't say. Where did I drop that gas can to? There it is. No? Alright then. And you have to have PS Plus or PC to still play monthly. She. 
Yeah, so I feel like GTA 6 is just gonna probably be like just one big scam. <laughs> oh, bad life! Missed you! All the subtlety and nuance of a neighbor. Like, it's just gonna be bad, like, flat out. Ali you I feel like the game is gonna be ass, yeah. Like so far I think the only disappointing game I've seen, like review wise, to happen this year, like we've had South Park Snow Day, which I've been told has been like one of the biggest missed opportunities ever. <laughs> and um the Star Wars Battlefront remastered collection they put out recently as well, I've been told is gonna be well it was really bad. Alfred. I feel like GTA 6 story won't be good. Yeah, I mean that's the downside to it. Like it probably won't be good. Last radius and prevented the toxin from spreading into the city. But what about Scarecrow or this Arkham Knight character? They've got tanks, missiles. Their forces are all over Gotham. Crane got away. I was exposed to his toxin. But no, like I don't really know about GTA 6. Really, I would wait till the game eventually comes out. But it's over now. I freely got to hand it to Scarecrow. I've never been a fan of his concoctions up till now, but this batch, it's uh, <laughs> intoxicating. It really brings out the me in you. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, did you hear what I said? Commissioner <laughs> Sorry, Alfred, I kind of zoned out there a little bit. I was thinking Thanks. about Mark Hamill. <laughs> Jim. You got out. See, I said you wouldn't let me down. I need to speak to you. Sure. <laughs> Meet me outside GCPD prisoner detention. I'm but yeah, like, now. to be fair, I, I don't remember, like, most GTA stories, honestly, from, like, any of the games. Half the time. Alfred, analyze the militia forces, troop deployments, equipment, movements. I want to know exactly Ending, what Ending, kill Jason, total Lucia. Oh. It'll be a decisions, decisions. You might fool everyone else, but you can't fool me. There's something different. Because I'm pretty sure there's like. So I know there's another ending in the game as well. Like you got the one where um. Lock them away deep in your subconscious. Was it like one of the endings to the game is where? Was it? There's like an ending where you don't 100 percent the game, but there's an ending when you do. There we go. Do nothing, they both die. Oh, fair enough then. I don't think I've ever killed a firefighter before. Really? I can't remember how I ended the game the first time round, actually. I think I had Lucius die in my first playthrough. My second playthrough, I never really got around to finishing it. Play in all honesty. His daughter's been kidnapped, <laughs> and it's all your fault. I've got to go. Batman's here. But obviously, this will be my third playthrough of the game. What's wrong? I might be able to make some changes. And my frames just fucking on, dipped. Scared. Then. It's Barbara. She's been taken. No, no, no. I spoke to her. She said she got out. She left hours ago. Stay calm. We'll get her back. <laughs> Which one? Alright, I feel like Who's we my little girl Scarecrow. They took her from the clock tower. I feel like they should actually or cast Brian Cranston to be, to be the new Commissioner Gordon. I'll follow. Stay in contact. GTA six ending. Some point, no, both main players <laughs> kill each other. Yes. Right there, It'll be like the ending to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Jim, I need you to stay focused. It's dangerous out there. Oh shit. <laughs> Hold on. Why did I let this happen? spill something on my There's no way you could have predicted this, Jim. It's my job to predict it as a cop and a father. The whole thing's gone down on my watch.
fucking spilt coffee on myself. I thought that Commissioner Gordon was nice enough to stop for me. <laughs> but yeah, I know, like, was it another, like, going a little bit off topic, yeah. Like, if we had a, um, because well, obviously James Gunn is rebooting the DC Universe. I feel like we should have Brian Cranston as the new Commissioner Gordon. So that would actually be really good. Come on. If you had to kill Bruce or Tim, or me, who would you kill? Probably Tim Drake, because he's just worthless. But he becomes Red Robin, so what? No one cares about Red Robin. But what, is, what has he actually done? It's too dangerous, Jim. Get in the Batmobile. I'll take us to the clock tower. Well, I know obviously with with you as Jason Todd. Well, obviously I know you become Red Hood, but yeah, then you got like Tim Drake. Like, what, what does he do? Just get us there in one piece, Batman. <clears throat> he does We're nothing. Out of time. And then obviously I can't kill Bruce Wayne because he's like the money maker of DC right now. <laughs> Tim is useless. Yes, he is. Arguably the worst of the Robins, other than the Starro one. What have you got, Alfred? I've sent the Bat Computer to analyze militia presence across the three islands and provide you with a real-time representation of the occupation's strength in each zone. As you can see, Miyagani Island cool. is heavily occupied, with a substantial drone ground force controlling the road. He's the worst Robin in the Arkham game. Yeah, he is. Founders Island is the militia stronghold, protected by... Oh, there is literally no doubt about that. <laughs> I'd recommend keeping the Batmobile away from there for the time being. The remaining drone forces on Bleak Island have been redeployed to protect the clock tower, so expect significant resistance. Thanks, Alfred. I'm heading there now. <laughs> Thank you, Alfred. But then again, I would say like one of the more underrated Robins yes, is probably. I shall not know. Maybe the female Robin from the Dark Knight Returns um, graphic novel. But then again, that's also because I'm a sucker for Frank Miller. Move it. Then again, I also do prefer like Frank Miller's design of Batman as well, like the old, rougher, fatter, big chin Batman. He's using high caliber rounds, titanium tipped, and maybe tungsten carbide. Whatever it is, it's ripping us to shreds. Stop him! Neat. I did it. There are militia troops all over the clock tower, Jim. You'll be safe in the Batmobile. I'll let you know when the area is secure. I'm not just sitting here while you go after those bastards. Yes, you are, Jim. Barbara wouldn't want <laughs> you to get yourself killed. Be patient, I'll Jim. Be in touch the minute I'm done. A second. In Asylum, you can find my cell. Wait, really? Well, I know there's like, like other um, villain cells. 
in there. Like, I know you can find like Mr. Freezes cell in that game, and obviously like Calendar Man's and everyone else's, and the cell where they're hiding Hush. Huh? Who knew? Jim, the area is secure. Meet me in the clock tower. I hear crap going on outside and it is annoying me. <laughs> and my phone charger just disconnected itself. Come on. My cell wall writing has me getting tortured on the wall and get, with me waiting for Batman. Ah, okay. It's a neat little uh, detail. Oh, cool, we're at the midway point of the killing joke. Cool. Colleen? You In Arkham again? VR, you can hear my screams. I've only played a little bit of Arkham VR, I never actually finished it. Candy grab. <laughs> Are we gonna finally figure out if he actually did, uh. Oh, don't pass out just do the yet. big no no to her? Show a little spy. So I think that was like one of the biggest debatable things as well, like the killing joke just has one of the big like several massive debates. It's like did um did Joker actually touch Barbara in the no no spot? We don't know. Did Batman kill Joker at the end of the killing joke again? We don't know. Alright, Babs. That is what happens. Cool. There we go. Back to reality. You can also find the room where I got tortured in inside of the asylum. Oh, okay, that's kind of neat. bats. And now a front row seat to the main event. You would have thought old Jim Gordon had been through enough. First, some handsome young maniac cripples his daughter. Now he's <laughs> blaming himself for her being taken. You really should tell him this. <laughs> Commissioner Gordon has been way <laughs> through way too much. I mean, it's not My like dude deserves to break. Well, <laughs> not yet anyway. The night's still young. That is kind of funny, actually. I did recently find out that, um... After doing a little bit of a research, Jim, way up. I can't do that now. Yeah, after doing a a tad bit of research, I found out that um, okay. the guy who plays Commissioner Gordon in the Gotham TV series plays Batman in Batman Year One, which I thought was actually kind of neat. I was like, ah, oh, cool. So you got the pleasure of playing both Batman and Commissioner Gordon. <laughs> they shouldn't have cancelled that TV show, actually. I should have been here. There's something I need to show you. We haven't got time. She's not like us. <laughs> when I tell Commissioner Gordon I got something to show him, I just show him a bunch of memes instead. Strong, Jim. Stronger than you realize. She works for you? Don't worry, Commissioner. I've been paying her full time. Find her. She's my family! My daughter! She's all I've got! Well, sucks to be you, Jimmy boy. I never should have trusted you. Never! 
<laughs> I'll do this on my own. <laughs> no, Jim. Stay away from my family. No. <laughs> well, fuck you too, Jim. Well then. I think that went quite well, considering. Of course, I wouldn't have told him, but that's why it's so liberating being me. You've got a lot to look <laughs> forward to, Bats. I need to find out what happened to Barbara. They covered their tracks by disabling the clock tower security camera. Well, I guess he just kind of dipped. If I hack the municipal CCTV system, I should be able to monitor all access points to the building. That's the Arkham Knights militia. That's the Arkham Knight. He's got Barbara. I need to confirm which car he took her in. There. That's the vehicle they okay. took Barbara away in. Those tires are Amortech D60s. I can program the Batman. D60s the nuts. It'll lead me right to them. All right, neat, 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 neat. Now that I think about it, how did Scarecrow know to go after your IT department? I mean, I had no idea. The killer is mutilating and posing his victims and then putting them on display. Actually, I might do one of the DLC missions instead. Batman. That crazy son of a bitch Jervis Tech just walked into the precinct and handed himself in. He says he's taken hostages. Wants to talk to you. I'm on my way. Don't let anyone speak to him until I get there. When I swept Barbara off her feet. <laughs> Poor old Jimbo had to make do with a slideshow. Damn it, I'll go downstairs. Shit, I'm going the wrong way. Dogs and hoodlums might be your usual prey, but my army is no such pack of cowards. Alright, how in oh wait, hold on. Maybe I actually need the Batmobile. Hey. Let's go! Man, I swear the ground shakes when that thing comes down the ramp. One of the ace workers saw it in action. He said he ain't never seen do anything like that before. You can't hide in here all night. This nightmare isn't gonna end for you. He's looking better, don't you think? He stopped screaming at least. Hey Owens, you okay? Come on, buddy, say something. Let's find Mad Hatter. You're here, Batman. Cash was ready to tear him a new rabbit hole. Ha! He's gonna make him a new butthole. Oh, fragile day, Kalukale. The Batman's here. It's time to play. I'm not playing your twisted games, Jervis. The hostages. Where are they? Oh, let's see. Let's see. Oh, one, two, three. A hat trick of your boys in blue. 
Do they live or die? That's up to you. <laughs> what have you done with them? Oh, such violent means. But all in vain. I've trained my mind <laughs> to feel no pain. Don't make me put that to the test. Oh, Batman! Allay your fears. Prick up your ears. You'll soon hear their tears. Just listen for the siren song. Yes, you'll find your Alice before too long. Oof. I've gone the wrong way. I just want to know, can I access the, um, never mind. Well, I think I'll probably end the stream here. Alright, I think I've got enough footage that I need. One eternity later. I'll try and see if I can get any of the alternative skins on on here. Um I think it's in the showcase bit. That's just too funny, that is. 
Alright, the 89. I know it's... I know it's race only, but... Yeah. The original Arkhamobile. The Tumblr. Batman v Superman 1. Alright. What skins have I got? The basic bat suit. Then we've got the other... The upgraded bat suit. New 52. Cool. Alright. Earth 2 Dark Knight. The other one worn by Bruce's dad. Bat Noel. Batman Incorporated. Flashpoint Batman. The 89 suit. So this is the first time I'm actually seeing all these ones. 70s Batman. The Arkham Origin. Oh, okay, that's kind of cool. Got the Arkham Origin suit. The iconic grey Batman suit. Yeah, from the early appearances of the comics. And you got the first appearance suit, which is kind of cool. Batman Beyond. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that one. Also, they do have the Robert Pattinson Batman suit in this. Okay. And you got the Dark Knight one. And you got the Batman v Superman one. I know I'm wasting time, but I just thought it would be nice just to look through it all. And you got the Arkham Asylum suit. Uh, the Dark Knight Returns suit. You have the Frank Miller suit. And then you got Base Robin. Yeah. Well, Tim Drake. Then we got the 52 Robin. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Then you got the one year later suit. The original Tim Drake suit. Then we got Selena Kyle. Well, the default one. You got the 60s series, the 90s series. Actually, I want, I want to see it render first. Yeah. And you got the 90s Catwoman suit. Which I don't recall. I think it was probably just the comics. You even got Nightwing. The new 52. Yeah, the Bloodhaven version. The original Arkham Nightwing suit. Christ. And you got default Harley. And you got the classic suit. It's kind of cool. Red Hood. Yeah. Everyone loves a little bit of the Red Hood. Arkham Knight. And that's literally it. So I can be the Dark Knight, well, the Arkham Knight if I wanted to. But yeah, I think I'll probably stick with the um, the base suits. No, I think I'll stick with the default. No, not default. Default. <laughs> so I'm gonna try and do one of the sides things. I can't leave Enigma at large. I'll find his trophies and put him behind bars. Actually, no, because what was it? It was one of the... Yeah, it was the Mad Hatter one I was doing. One of Hatter's hostages is near the Lady of Gotham. I need to find them. <laughs> Sorry, Jim. I'm destroying part of the police station. You ain't driving nowhere. <laughs> it's funny. Haha, <laughs> funny man go wee!
Aha, uh -huh, there we go. There's a hostage in the trunk, but the car's wired to blow. I'll need to defuse the explosive first. No, I'm gonna open it anyway, because let's see what happens. I don't like I don't like how this is done. What's up? The Cheshire cat all grinning. But don't be fooled. Don't think you're winning. <laughs> Bro, I can do a, uh, a Cheshire cat smile. You got a smile like haha -ha, funny. Chasing down some rioters and the siren went all screwy. I had to pull over. Next thing I know, I'm waking up in the dark with that siren blaring. Oh. <sighs> I would never end. You're safe now. I'll send someone to pick you up. <laughs> on this remote island that I we're on. I found one of the hostages. I'm sending you the location. You got it, Batman. Any leads on the others? I'm working on it. Just say the word and I'll go down there and make that bastard talk. It's <laughs> under control, Cash. Leave it to me. I'll make the beastie talk. Hatter has a hostage near the lighthouse off Bleak Island. I need to find them. I should have gone the other way first. It is good to be back. Gotham Joker. Without me, was it? I mean, Scarecrow's the biggest bad guy in town. <laughs> Not for long. There we go. I don't need to worry about the riots and all that crap. So I know it's not a crime in progress like in the uh, older games. He despises you, this Arkham Knight. What did you do, hero, to enkindle such hatred? I'll say that could have been important for later. Come on, where are you? Alright, so I gotta keep an eye out. There he is. Alright, copper. Hey. 
I was going to panic then for a moment. How many is that now? <laughs> so now obviously I've got to kick the shit out of him. It's okay. You're safe. I thought I'd never get out of there, Batman. That noise. What the hell happened to me? It's over now. <laughs> I do not know. To GCPD. Thanks. Cash. I've secured the second hostage. Good job, Batman. I'll send someone to pick them up. Alright, so I've got one more to find. Mad Hatter has a hostage near Merchant Bridge. The siren should lead me to the exact location. See how close I can get to it. <clears throat> you style yourself as a guardian, Batman, a protector. Yet you cannot even guard your friends. I don't need friends, some Batman. I already see it. Shit, did I go past it? There it is. Hey, this shit's fucking confusing. The rabbit is gone. He's off the way. I'm sure he only wants to play. Return the book, and then we'll find how little Alice lost her mind. Cash, the last car was empty. Any word on the missing officer? Sergeant Laurie actually just showed up at the precinct. Said he blacked out, woke up without his car. That's everyone accounted for. I don't buy it, Batman. <laughs> Tetch is up to something. I'll make him talk. He ain't the only one with tricks up his sleeve, Batman. Let me know if you need a hand or a hook. <laughs> hmm. No, I'm not. Right. 
Damn, that was clean. <laughs> God damn! Things not working out the way you planned. What is that? Out there with you! God, get it away from me! Move. Night returns, all filled with malice. Tell me, Batman, did you find your Alice? No more games. I found a Jeremy. book. Where's the other hostage? Oh, yeah, why, yes, there's three. Oh, silly me. The answer's in the book, Batman. Open and see. Tell me! There's no joke, no joke. Control your rage. The answer is there. Just turn the page. <laughs> I ain't falling for your shit. Down the rabbit hole you fall <laughs> where madness reigns from wall to wall. Through the rhyming words we tumble, where villains toil and psychics Oh my crumble. god, I got a makeover! <laughs> I got redesigned to cell shaded. Welcome to my wonderland. It's time to play a game. I'm here to make you understand what drives a man insane. Crazy world we now inhabit. All you have to kick do some ass. Follow the white rabbit. Follow the white rabbit. Yeah, cause these are all literally just the same design of the guys from Arkham Asylum. No. Nailed it. I owe you quite a debt. Oh, look who's here. White rabbit there wallowing. Freedom waits for the one who's following. Mirror. Where's the rabbit? Oh, the white rabbit. I would if I knew where he was. There Hold he is. Still, let me help you. <laughs> you're late. You're late. The page is turning. Keep a balance. I know you're turning. Wow! I can see all the pores in his nose. Fun we had in Arkham City, dear Alice. She never looked so pretty. <laughs> Until you snapped and crushed my hat. <laughs> Come on. Come now, Alice. Don't be late. Follow the rabbit and steal your cake. We got this. Because of you, I broke every finger in me hand. It's okay. You're safe. Ah! Sorry, Alice. It's not yet time. Another page, and I'll make you mine. <laughs> He's back at it again. Ah, Hallow's Eve. Gotham burns, it's here the story twists and turns. 
the final chapter will be fine. Our little Alice lost her mind. <laughs> The one I want to keep alive for now is the Riddler one. Cleanse those discs, smash Rabbit's brain, do it, Alice, end his pain. Give me your Riddler trophies. Where are you, Alice? Where'd you go? Oh, this isn't right. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no. I'll never be like you, Joe. I am only Saiyan. I'll never be like you. Look at that receding hairline. Oh, Alice. No, this can't be. <laughs> no. There's tea for two. We can still be friends. Bitch, you thought. Move. 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 Go away. Stop looking at me. Can't hide in here all night. That's what you think. Wait, what's the population of our prison right now? Ah. So we're not at max capacity just yet. And yeah, unfortunately, Jimmy Jim Gordon will have to wait. Find Ripper's trophy, all of them, and draw him out. You've got to solve a certain number of trophies. Alright. That's got to tell me where on the map I can find some of them. Or unless it just wants me to continue through a certain part of the story. So now obviously you got the Riddler's actual area where he hides. Nice driving idiot is right there. Just go! You wanna take the wheel? That ain't no mask, man. He had surgery after the <laughs> Damn it, I killed him. Hmm. I wish Joker's Funland was still open. No lines 
for the Ferris wheel. Uh. <laughs> So yeah, how does one get to it though? Unless I gotta use the remote control battery. So unless I You know Hugo Strange is the lecturer's like scarecrow, but but he sent food packages too, you know? I have legitimately no clue how to solve that. Huh. So I just drive around and find something else. Uh, what's my buddy Ethan sent me? No. <laughs> How long will you struggle, Batman? How long will you struggle? Nice, that. Yes. Like I said, unless there's a Riddler puzzle room I gotta do. I got no clue. The rioters have taken the firefighters hostage and gone to ground across the city. I'll hunt them down and make them pay. Actually, no, I'll just... Fuck it, I'll just carry on with the mission. It don't... it, it don't matter for now. Oh.
Yes. Hi, diddle diddle detective. I see you've begun pitting that mediocre mind of yours against my riddles. I had plenty of time to conceive it. When they said there was an army out there, they really meant it. Oh crap! It's Batman! Get us out of here! Oh god, what's he doing? What's he doing? He's tailing us! Keep driving! And <laughs> double kill. Got the right equipment for that. The tire tracks will lead me to Barbara. I can use the Batmobile forensic scanner to follow them. Alfred, I want the uh. Arkham Knight's name. As do I, Master Bruce. He has presumably chosen that title for a reason. Where do you suggest we start? Arkham City. Go through the files of every inmate who was released following the death of Hugo Strange. And Alfred. Sir. They knew about Barbara. Activate the Batcave security protocol. Yes. Don't drop your guard. I've got a horrible plan, man. Now you can tell who I am. You just gotta find me. The Gotham's a big place. And it's a whole He's in a plane! And a Beyblade. Alfred, the militia have deployed a device. It's burrowed deep into the road. Yes, I see it. Similar devices are being planted across the city. I'll investigate. Cool. It is a boom. Bomb, Alfred. A well armored one. Oh dear. <laughs> oh shit. Should you really be standing quite so close? I'm going to set up a remote link to the bat computer and hit it with every virus we've got. Once we're hacked in, I can expose the core and defuse it with a controlled explosion. Very good, Sam. Though nice. I should warn you that the militia has already deployed a platoon of its unmanned tanks to stop you. They won't. Well, it's a good thing they're unmanned, otherwise we'll we'll always picture Batman as being some sort of monster. Oh. 
There we go. Nailed it. Cauldron unit destroyed. The bomb's payload is exploded. I can use the power winch to trigger a controlled explosion. Hey, I did it. You think that's it, Dark Knight? I've got this whole city wired to blow. Try and disarm the explosives, and you'll face even more of my drones. You see, I've waited years. No one is taking this from me. Look at a charred crater if they try. Sir, that warning was broadcast publicly. I suspect the Arkham Knight wishes to discourage outside intervention. He's on our tail. I'll run that thing. Come on, lose him. Where? Come on. Alright. If anyone here is purring, it's probably because of my cat. You move. Ow, your clothes are a bit Tell sharp me today. You know. Alright, I'll talk. Just don't hurt me. Good. <laughs> no, away from the mic. I'm away from the microphone. That's it. I just want to save Barbara. I'm imagining. I've gotta be imagining it. Who would chain a body to a wall? Alfred, the Arkham Knight's trail leads into Miyagani Island. Lower the Mercy Bridge. must have hardwired into the transport control system. Hmm. Find me their access point. Right. Tracing the network traffic, it seems to have all been rerouted to Grand Avenue Station. Then that's where they'll be. I'll proceed on foot and take over their access point. I'll contact you when you're able to lower the bridge. Be careful, sir. Miyagani Island is rife with militia drones and troops. Ali <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's roughly around this point as well where, I, where we get our first introduction to like man bat. The station's crawling with the Arkham Knights militia. I need to clear them out and find the access point they're using to Shit, I got a bit too high. Network.
a vantage point. Well, you better hurry fast because you're running out of dudes. I just fucking grabbed him through the fucking wall. All oh, your asses in there. With the Arkham Knight's men taken care of, I can use their uplink terminal to lower the bridges. <laughs> you don't say. Brucey Bruce Isn't man. Barbara's job? Oh, right. In all the excitement, I almost forgot. <laughs> you don't really believe old Jimbo's. Wait, hold up. Hold that thought. There we go. I am now strong. I'm gonna forgive you if you save her. He holds a garage bats. I should know. Alfred, I've re-enabled the bridge controls. Marvelous. But marvelous, sir. Now, forget Scarecrow. It's time to face your one true nemesis, Batman. Oh dear. Is that who I think it is? Enigma. Contact me when you're ready with the bridge. It is I, Edward Enigma. Why would a bad man visit an abandoned orphanage? Eddie, sweetie, you confuse me with Robin. The big guy and I aren't all that close. Oh, oh, I know. It's because of what will happen to his feline friend if he doesn't get here in time. Shot, Dark Knight, stunned. You didn't expect this, did you? That is because you are no match for me, Edward Nigma, the Riddler, and your intellectual superior. Did you think I would just forget our last meeting, Dark Knight? You humiliated me. Well, considering the fact that I didn't really collect all the Riddler trophies in Arkham City. <laughs> you cannot do it. I have one already. I think I did like majority of them in Arkham Origins. I will stand triumphant over your bloody corpse. And as the dim light fades for good in your tiny dullard's mind, your final thought will be how I have bested you. Come to the orphanage, detective, or she dies. Come on. In the butt. <laughs> Listen here, fatty. You heckin' Which chunker. Catwoman. Tell me why. Ain't nothing but a heartbreak. Why? What's Nigma's play? I ain't got a clue. I just brought it here and planted some of these trophies nearby. That's it. You gotta believe me. I do. Uh. Hmm. Well, Batman, damn, Selena. That had better be you. Keep still. Are you okay? Perfect. What little girl doesn't dream of being bait for her strapping dark night? We're leaving. You might be. Well, Selena Kyle, you're looking oh, damn fine. Are finally here. Tonight, folks, we've got riddles galore. But first, let me introduce my beautiful assistant. Mm. Oh, I 
I'm growing tired of my dependence upon the least useless dregs I can scrape from Gotham's utterly uninspired underbelly, underbelly. why rely on others for help when you can design, program, engineer, and manufacture it yourself? Nice. So yeah, we're playing as both Catwoman Smash it. and Batman. What a pair you make. Together, you're just competent enough to survive. Enjoy it while it lasts, Dark Knight. I have more in store for you than hitting things. Nice. <laughs> no doubt you enjoyed that, Detective. It's the most fun you'll have all night. You see, Dark Knight, this feisty felonious feline has been fitted with a shiny new collar. With each challenge you complete, you'll get one little key. Collect every key and the kitty goes free. Remove it too soon and the kitty goes boom! <laughs> All right, that laugh was actually pretty humorous. challenge already. So let's see how long it takes for you to turn a running start into a stumble and fall. Take that rocket-fueled roadster and head on over to Chinatown, detective. Your hmm. second test is waiting. All righty. Actually, I'll come back for you. Stay here. I'm wearing a bomb, Batman. Of course I'm staying here. Go get my keys. It's unlike you to get caught. Was it an ambush? Blackmail? A trap? He invited me. What? He said he had a job. A job? Of the cat burgling variety. Her. I'm pretty good at it, remember? Not all of us scamper around on rooftops at night because we want to help people, you big brooding boy scout. Now where's my key? Don't keep me waiting. <laughs> Sir, I've regained control of the bridges. Good Damn it, work. Alfred! I'll contact you when I'm in position at Mercy Bridge. Well, Batman, old boy, this is quite the dilemma, isn't it? Do you save the incompetent? I need to go back to the bridge to bring the Batmobile onto the Agani Island. Personally, I go see Eddie's latest contrived death gauntlet. I'm sure he went to a lot of trouble. Besides. <laughs> You can't save all of Barbara. I killed half of her already. Let's have a look. Sweet Sir, intel. A GCPD helicopter has reported one of the missing fire crew being held hostage in the Grand Avenue area. I'm afraid we don't have an exact location. Good luck. Can't you say that, Alfred? But once I get down there, I'm going to kick some ass. What's up? I'll let him get that one lucky hit in. Nailed it. Batman, over here. You always go give him that fighting chance to let him have that one lucky hit. There we go. Thought the game fucking stopped there for a sec. Thank you. I was dead for sure. Those animals. Think, what do you remember about the attack? The chief had us heading back into the city, searching for civilians. He said we weren't leaving anyone behind, and, and then from nowhere, this fireball or something slammed into us. I must have blacked out. Next thing I know, one of these psychos is stubbing a cigarette out on me. Have you found the others? What about the chief? I'm still looking. Wait <laughs> here. I'll arrange for the things we got to take out Firefly. At some point in this game. A 
challenge beneath Chinatown. Fine, Enigma. I'll play your games and I'll win. Selena's life depends on it. Damn, that freaking really frightened the shit out of me. The bat creature's still at large on Miyagani Island. I'm going to hunt it down and take a blood sample. Uh, who or what it is. Got this giant winged beast. Damn it, almost had him as well. Her gravity is a cruel mistress. There we go, got him. Now give me your blood, bitch. Come on, man, back. analysis on the blood sample I just uploaded. Right you are, Master Bruce. I'm searching for possible matches now. <laughs> How you managed to get this sample is beyond me, sir. Ah, here we are. Well, the blood is heavily mutated, but we have a partial match. A oh. Dr. Kirk Langstrom. Search for any properties in Gotham owned or leased by Dr. Langstrom. Certainly. Uh, let me see. Ah, he and his wife lease a basement laboratory in Chinatown. I'm sending you the address. Cool. So that's two things I've got to find in Chinatown. I got him! Target! I need to go back to the bridge to bring the Batmobile on to the island. Bridge to pick up the trail of the Arkham Knight's vehicle. Miss Gordon, safety is on all of our minds, sir. Good luck. No, I'm not really there to get Barbara Brack. I'm just there to try and fucking stop some dubious shit from going on. Plus, I just want to get my car back. Mm-hmm. 
that was crazy shit. All right, let's, do, let's get this. I'll play your games and I'll win. Let's say let's get the fucking red little thing out of the way. Get there as fast as possible. Because I am fast as fuck, boy. You see what that thing does to cars? I ain't staying. Don't worry, guys, you don't have to worry about nothing. isn't it? The opportunity to even glimpse my greatness, the dawning realization of just how insignificant, how unworthy of note you really are. Really are. These trials are my masterpieces, detective. detective. When I have defeated you, they will become monuments to my genius. genius. Testaments to your stupidity. <laughs> Crowds of school children will pack themselves <laughs> in this elevator, eager to see for themselves the place where the Dark Knight was defeated. <sighs> they won't understand a thing, of course, but they'll come. <laughs> come. I wonder if this is another race. So obviously you got puzzles as well. Should manage a feeble grasp of the premise. You must provide power to this board, detective. 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 Mm. You know, Dark Knight, on balance, I don't think you're going to figure this out. Figure this out. Bold of you to assume, Eddie boy. So I think I might have it. I just had to jump in, didn't I? together and you just might produce a spark. I got the power. Well, well, you figured it out. Or blundered your way to victory. Blundered. Time to help Catwoman with her key. 
Now then, detective, detective. hop on the pressure pad beside me. There we go. Listen carefully, Dark Knight. Dark Knight. Your friend's life depends on it. Back in the orphanage, a series of glass cabinets have appeared in front of Catwoman. Isn't that right, my dear? I see them, Eddie. Good. One of those cabinets, my dear, has your first key inside. The others? They contain less useful keys. Keys that will unlock the admittedly slight contents of your skull all over the orphanage walls. Okay, Batman. Let's do this one, try. Let's see if you're as smart as they say. This is where I, I pick the first key and it's the first one that does not work. One down. Just this Dang. once, I've lowered the count on Catwoman's collar by two digits to account for Batman's earlier success. I could have simply started the count on eight, but, well, nine lives? I couldn't resist. Resist. Hmm. Now, Catwoman, celebrate your survival by telling Batman all about the exciting orphanage development. About the exciting orphanage development. No. You do it. No, kitty. Kitty. <laughs> Why, Batman, there's a big mysterious green door. Yes, yes, there is. Come back to the orphanage, Batman, and I'll let the pair of you through it. <laughs> No, I just gotta remember the way they came through. Yes! Well done, Dark Knight. You should, I hope, be beginning to comprehend the breadth of the tasks ahead of you, the sheer scale of the gauntlet I have thrown down. Or perhaps not. Perhaps, perhaps you're feeling cocky. Perhaps these early victories have filled you with early false hopes. Oh. Well then, ride that wave of smug satisfaction all the way back to the orphanage. orphanage. I'm waiting. Uh, orphanage. Hmm. <laughs> what an asshole. Langstrom. There must be a cause for this transformation. His lab might hold the answer. Proceed with caution, sir. The creature could well be hiding in familiar surroundings. He basically tried to turn himself into Morbius.
This is where it gets crazy. Kirk? Honey? Are you okay? He's about to morb. Strange. Blunt trauma to the head. Langstrom had no idea what he was doing. No, that's all. Go on. Just be yourself. Okay. <clears throat> Full genetic resplicing was a success. The recombinant molecule. Honey, you're doing it again. How about in English? Yes, of course. Sorry. Aha, there we are. That's one computer. Looking. Maybe it contains some answers. A cam this computer tour. stores all of Dr. Langstrom's research. Hmm. Mixing his DNA with a vampire bat? That was never going he to definitely happen. tried to turn himself into Morbius. If I search through his files. I may be able he, to create he an morbed. to his condition. I need to isolate the man bat signature and remove it from Langstrom's DNA. Almost. I think I get it now. That's it. Nailed it. I've created a clean DNA sample. Now all I need to do is make him take his medicine. <laughs> Let's go beat the shit out of him. Alfred, I've synthesized a cure in Langstrom's lab. Now I just need to find him. Any idea where he may be hiding? He's not in control of his actions. He could be anywhere. No one knows this city better than you, Master Bruce. Hmm. You'll find him. His wife? Your parents? <laughs> what is it about dead relatives that turns you into a giant rodent? <laughs> yeah, well, Joker, how about you and your dead wife, which caused you to become a clown? How about that? Because your wife died in a gas explosion that was actually operated by the Mafia. Yeah, I read The Killing Joke. I know what that shit's all about. We still never find out what the Joker's real name is. Alright, you safe from that? The militia have deployed one of the devices near Grand Avenue. Time for a bomb. I'm gonna get rid of a bomb. Do the one thing that Adam West actually struggled to do. <laughs> because some days you just can't get rid of a bomb. Scarecrow took Commissioner Gordon's kid. That's pretty cold, you ask me. <laughs> you had enough yet, punk? Speak up, we can't hear you. <laughs> Nailed it. The <laughs> asshole. Alpha target wiped out the drone unit in Kingston. Oh shit.
offline. Get back. <laughs> Send more drones. Direct hit on Rattler. Armor still holding. Damn you, Batman. Ha. <laughs> Bitch, you thought. Beginning hack now, sir. Militia force is imminent, Master Bruce. Target sighted. Destroy him. Drone flag initiated. Rattler down. Bitch, you fucking thought. It just took out the bomb's the payload is exploded. I can use the power winch to trigger a controlled explosion. Got it. Bomb destroyed. Nicely done, Master Bruce. Alright. You're not taking any more from me, Batman. Next time, you'll die trying. Shit, wrong one. Such worthless promises. There we go. I had to reset the fucking thing. From what I hear, Scarecrow nearly turned the whole Ace Chem factory into a bomb. Batman sight. Rattler's hit. It's still operational.
come on. Fuck yeah, Marvel, you get rid of this. Expect minor resistance, Master Bruce. Batman's here. Surround him, destroy him. We lost one, sir. He's making you look like a fool. Bitch, you thought. Oh, come on. Should examine the vehicle more closely. I fucking thought I heard something outside. The car veered off an empty road. Why? Looks like the driver wasn't wearing his seatbelt. I should find the body. Oh, my eyes itchy. There we go. There he is. Traces of pepper spray on the right side of the driver's face. Oracle must have been in the passenger seat and deliberately caused the crash. Clever. I should check the area where she was sitting.
Oof. There we go. The door was torn off during the crash. If I can find where it came to rest, I can determine exactly what happened. It was around there. It is. Torn cleanly off the hinges, the door must have been opened before the crash. Oracle got out. I need to examine the reconstruction, pinpoint where she landed. vehicle before the crash. Oracle stopped here. Someone took a shot at her. I should analyze the point of impact for ballistic evidence. The caliber of the weapon is a match for the Arkham Knight's sidearm. Huh. The trajectory and impact velocity points to a shooter that matches his height. At this range, he couldn't have missed. A warning shot. something. Oracle knew she couldn't escape, but she caused this crash for a reason. She must have left a clue while crawling away. An SD card. Mr. Way. Lucius, Oracle left me the scrambler device at the scene of the crash. Decrypt the data so I can pinpoint the Arkham Knight's location. Ah, this kind of thing was more Miss Gordon's specialty. I'll see what I can do, but it'll take me a little while. <laughs> I'll meet you at Wayne Tower when you're ready. Alfred, give me an update on Gotham's most wanted. One moment, sir. Right, these two are just in. A mysterious hooded figure has been spotted on a rooftop in Grand Avenue. He hmm. appears to be standing beside a burning bat symbol, sir. It might be wise to establish whether this interloper is friend or foe. Hmm. Reports are also coming in of a blaze at the Bristol Fire Station. One suspects arson, sir, as the power to the building has been cut. Disabling the fire suppression system. You hmm. may wish to investigate. Cool. Well, I'll do so the riddle thing. Still trapped in the orphanage. Nigma's got something in store for us both when I get there. Eddie boy. Eddie boy, Eddie boy. Welcome back to the Riddletorium. Do not fear, your friend has not been armed. Before I allow you to see her, however, riddle me this. Riddle me this. 
What kind of question can only be asked upon reflection? Reflection. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> no, Dark Knight. You're way off the mark. The mark. Shit, I got around the wrong way. Well, well, it's there we go, I did it. Why, she'll be as surprised as I am that you've made it this far. They made it this far. Huh. <laughs> it's funny because I'm stupid. Eddie wouldn't show me whatever deranged parlor game he's got waiting behind that door until you arrived. I'll get you out of here. I'm sorry, do I seem testy? It's probably something to do with the gorgeous necklace Eddie picked out for me. Have you seen it? It explodes. Oh, I do hope you two are getting along, you two, because you'll need to work together if you want to find the key hidden in here. Find the key. Well, this looks creepy. Someone's been reading Feng Shui for serial killers. Oh, great. Extra trapped. As if the collar wasn't enough. Oh, Batman, Catwoman. Neither of you is getting out of there without the other's help. Four, five, two. Oh, look, it's more of Eddie's homemade friends. And then one, <laughs> three, is pointless, five. I don't have any friends two, at all. Four. So let's try that again. One, three, five. Two, four. Well, there we go. It's settled. It's settled. You're not quite as dumb as each other. Congratulations, Catwoman. Mm. Batman, you're lagging behind. Alright, so the, the other one is three one four three one four five two three oh shit three one five oh three one, four, five, two. Oh, dark night. I can barely describe to you what a pleasure it is to see your brow furrow over the simplest of conundrums. I do apologize for not creating a riddle that you can merely pound into submission. Here. Why don't you take out your primitive frustrations on my automated Here you go. Systems. Nailed it. Well then, it seems you've earned another key. This is going to take all night, isn't it? But unfortunately. I got to hit something. How are you holding up? I'm fine. I don't need your concern. Just your help getting this thing off. Huh. I wouldn't funny. celebrate just yet, you two. Before you finish that thought, Eddie. Eduardo. What I'm gonna do.
There we go, I've fully upgraded my tank's armor. Dark Knight, my next challenge can be found beneath Elliot Memorial Hospital. Elliot Memorial. Conveniently located for when you pass out due to mental exhaustion. Mental, mental, mental exhaustion. Cool. As long as I know. I won't give a fuck. Uh. <sighs> No one cares, Riddler. You might want to search the Bristol district, sir. Officers have reported hearing the same opera music associated with other crime scenes you investigated. Ask her out or what? You're not still torn up about Talia al Ghul, are you? Come on, it's been months. <laughs> you weren't in the court. You've probably forgotten about it by now. You're really gonna turn down this fine opportunity for romance just because I blew your last girlfriend's lungs out? <laughs> Take a tip from your wingman, Brutie. The ladies hate it when you brood over the ex you failed to save. Come in. Oh, I'll keep an eye out. You hear about Riddler? He's gone crazy. No crazier than usual, anyway. Alfred, I found yep. another body. The mutilation pattern looks to be identical to the previous murder. Another Professor Pig and it appears Gotham does abomination. I'm going to scan the body for unique identifiers. A surgical scar. I've seen that pattern of scar tissue before. It's a bite mark. Analyzing its radius points to a species of Salacomorpha. This particular variety of shark is only found in the waters off the coast of North Gotham. <laughs> you find it was actually King Shark, maybe. The victim is fitted with an ocular prosthesis. This specific type of medical grade acrylic was used only once during a trial five years ago. There we go. And some metal plating. Trauma to the upper arm. At some point, titanium screws have been implanted to repair a fractured humerus. Alfred, well, that's just not funny. If it's a humerus. Mendez. Uh, she had quite a troubled upbringing, sir. Orphaned age nine, foster homes, drug abuse. She developed a talent for surfing, hence the shark attack. Tragically, it's also how she lost her boyfriend. She was working for a Christian charity in Tucson, Arizona, when she went missing. Another person taken from outside the Gotham area. A significant detail, sir. So are these words written beside the bodies. Try and find a connection between the two victims I've found, Alfred. There has to be something linking them together. I'll try my best, sir. Hmm. And then... Fuck it. Someone's attacked the fire station in Bristol. I'm going to put out the blaze and find who's responsible. I've been waiting for a shot of you, Batman! I love how they go flying every time I run them over. Because my car is covered in tasers. The power to the fire suppression system has been cut. I need to get it back online to get the blaze under control. And... There he is. Firefly. You beat me once. But that's a long time ago.
Hey, shit, I lost him. Some cash. The Arkham Knight's drone deployment has been wiped out. Your men can resume patrols on Miyagani Island. You got it, Batman. Thanks. Zerial. I trust you have not forgotten me, Batman. Azrael. Dark days are here, Batman. The prophecy has come true. From the ashes of Arkham City, the fires are raging, and Gotham is burning. What do you want? I can see that same fire in your eyes. Before this night is through, that fire will consume you. Gotham will need a new savior, <laughs> a new guardian, a new Batman. I'm not finished just yet. You cannot carry this burden forever. I have studied you for a long time. You have a code. You will not kill. Then yeah, you will not I. kill, but I will. The Order has foreseen it. The time has come to pass the mantle to another warrior. To me. If you can prove your abilities, when the time is right, I'll consider it. But first, you must show you are worthy. Huh. <laughs> As you wish. Nice. You're stronger than I thought. Signal me when you're ready to be challenged again. Sir, I've captured Azrael's performance. Good work, Alfred. Run the usual physiological tests. Then am I to understand you're considering him as your successor? No. None of us know what will happen after tonight. I'll be in <laughs> but just be on the safe side. <laughs> Riddler's next trial is Crystal. He's losing Alfred, and that makes him dangerous. Perhaps the real challenge is tolerating his relentless self-aggrandizing commentary. <laughs> I'm not after you, I just want to do a race. The preliminaries are done with Dark Knight. I hope you understand that. Oh, had I so wished, you'd have failed before you had even begun to comprehend the very first hurdle. But no, no, no. I wanted you to know the full extent of my brilliance, you understand? <laughs> To fully appreciate my superiority. But Eddie, you're going a bit far, mate. Well, I'm not going easy on you anymore. Another racetrack detective, but please do not let its unique peculiarities crush your spirit. Well, shall we begin? No, Dark Knight, you are not losing what little grip you had on reality. <laughs> You've merely entered a brand new world of my design. Come on, detective. It's a linear course. Ceiling applies 300 dead bats of pressure, detective. I invented the measurement myself. Shit. That's several tons of metal slamming down upon you, Dark Knight. You may wish to avoid it. it. 
fuck. What happens when an unstoppable force meets an unredeemable idiot? I ain't gonna make this. I built this course in a sewer, detective. You needed the home team advantage. Is it because I'm a flying rodent? <laughs> Onward, Batman! Or does the dark night require a pit stop? Shit. Very good, Dark Knight. Again. Careful now, Batman. You didn't go to all the trouble of painting that thing just the right shade of black in order to scuff it. How do you notice, Batman? The walls of inevitability are closing in. Come on. That's it. I'm breaking it up. 500 dead bats of pressure. You know, I think the wheels on that thing might actually be as thick as your skull. Feeling claustrophobic, detective? Get ready for the final lap. What a fitting in for you, detective. A stain on my floor. You'll be crushed, flattened. Pulverized! Uh, any second now. It's time! One thousand dead bats of pressure! Shit! No, Batman, you can't drive through solid objects. It's really basic physics. Hey, fuck you, what you know about Get physics? Another lap would be the end of you, Dark Knight, and I can't quite bring myself to stop the fun so soon. Your next key awaits. The fun part. Ready to die, my dear? There we go. And here we go. Neat. Congratulations, Catwoman. You proved yourself able to follow simple directions. Dude. Simulation activated.
No, that's not good enough. Retry. Did it. With literally almost four seconds to spare. Continue. Woo! Where'd I go? I must say, Dark Knight, that your desperate fumblings have exceeded my admittedly rather <coughs> meager expectations. I am impressed. Eddie, 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 calm down, bitch. Using tools for the first time. Did you know, Detective, that the cleverest chimps can even obey simple instructions? It's true. Let's try it, shall we? Go to Gotham Casino for your next test, and I'll give you a banana. To be fair, that doesn't sound too bad. <laughs> Get a banana? Cause you know what they say, monkeys are um, always happy with well, positive reinforcement. Oh, already. Alright. I'm going to end the stream here. I'll see you lovely lads and ladies in the next one. Alright, I want to thank everyone for actually making it to this end of the video. Again, like I before said, please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that notifications bell so you guys will be up to date on everything that I upload into the channel. And also don't forget to go down in the description down below where you guys can find my, uh, my Instagram, my Twitch, my Twitter, the Facebook page, and my TikTok as well, which will be able to follow me and see what I post quite regularly on there. And without further ado, I'll see you lovely lads and ladies in the next one.